hi guys welcome back to my channel if you're new here my name is natalia i have an airpod in that i need to take out um so i run my channel i do lots of weight watchers content i film basically my daily weight loss journey also i film a little bit of like family vlogs here and there and like random videos honestly kind of just film whatever i want but mostly keep it weight loss weight watchers related because that is a huge part of my journey and so yeah, today I'm going to be filming a video that I've done once before. It was like my favorite foods of February and I asked you guys if you would like to see it like every other or every month. Like my food favorites that I like found or like that I discovered for that month or that I tried for that month. Sorry about the background. Zach and Gabriel are outside. That's why the door is open. Um, we're about to grill some chicken with some barbecue. It's going to be really good. But um, so yeah, I asked you guys if that would that was something that you guys would want to see and a lot of you did say yes but I haven't filmed one since February and it's now April so I've tried a few more things since then and I want to share what I have loved with you guys so I'm going to be filming that today I hope you guys enjoy I know not everyone is going to be able to find all of these things in the stores I know it's super hard for me to find certain things right now but <laughs> I I feel horrible like sharing food all the time but that is what my channel has been since day one so I am just trying to get back to as back to normal as possible and just get in the groove again so yeah I hate that not everybody can find the essential things that they need to succeed on Weight Watchers but yeah, it breaks my heart. I wish I could give you guys food and everything like that. <laughs> I know that I can't, so that's dumb to say, but yeah, I just want to throw that disclaimer out because I know it's hard to find food right now. I know I have to go to seven different stores to find fat-free cheese and stuff like that, so I know how it is, you guys, and yeah, I just wanted to give that disclaimer. So let's get into my new food favorite. So this is not in any order. I just laid everything out, and I'm going to grab it, so... First things first, I've tried this forever ago, like since I've started my weight loss journey, but I've, try I've tried a life-changing thing to do with them. You might have seen it in one of my What I Eat In A Days. I feel like there's something in my teeth, <laughs> but basically, I take like four tablespoons of this, it ends up being like two or three points, um, some jalapenos, like out of the jar, the jalapenos and the bite-sized Tostitos. I have a bag of them, but I don't want to go get them. But the bite-sized Tostitos, pour this over your to Tostitos or like in a bowl and add the jalapenos. It tastes like movie theater nachos, like the kind that you get at the movie theaters. Oh, it is so good. You guys have to try. It's like five or four, like an eight point addition to whatever, a snack, a lunch, it's kind of high, but if you're ever craving like that movie theater nacho, this is so good. So this is the Fritos Mild Cheddar. My favorite is the Jalapeno, but I'm out of that one. Um, but this is so good. It's a little bit expensive for this tiny little can, but I just like this more than Tostitos. It is so good, I love it. So next is a Built Bar. So I ordered like a bunch of different flavors a while back and um i've been trying them a lot of them i don't really like that much but this one i've tried a couple of times now this is the banana nut bread sorry if it's not focusing but it's the banana nut bread and oh my gosh you guys this is like banana laffy taffy to me which i know sounds so weird but i love bananas i am such a banana person like i just eat them for snacks all the time i add them in smoothies I like banana bread it's just I love bananas so this is right up my alley and I don't like a lot of built bars that they're coming out with I, I just think they're coming out with too many flavors and they're not they're not all good like I feel like they're not taking their time on the flavors like and making them as good as they could be um, but this one is very good this is an old flavor I believe I don't think it's new at all but it's very good so if you've never tried this one and you do like that banana taste definitely give it a try it's kind of kind of tastes like a banana dipped in chocolate or something like that so good um, but you definitely have to like bananas to like that one so try it if you haven't already the next thing is this Jihoo steak sauce so I've only used a tiny tiny bit of this 
but we made steak once like a couple of weeks ago and i'm the only one that likes steak sauce so but i saw this at public public tends to have like a lot of new things that are like acceptable on my weight loss journey so like sugar-free items and things like that most of these items i do find at publix and not walmart but they have this g hughes sugar-free steak sauce which i've never saw before i never saw it at walmart they it might or might not be like new so that's why i haven't seen it at walmart but i saw it when i was at publix and i was like i am a steak sauce person i literally get like people like degrade me for liking steak sauce but i just think it adds something to steak steak is good by itself but it definitely just adds something so i love this this is so good and for a sugar-free steak sauce it's like won my heart it is so good i don't remember the points on it and i would totally scan it for you if i was near my phone i'll leave it on the screen but oh my gosh you guys have to try this if you like steak sauce i was even thinking about making like a steak burger or something like that not like a steak burger but like a hamburger steak and putting this on it and oh that would just be so good anyway the next item i literally just tried a couple of days ago um a couple of days ago zach brought me home like these sugar-free russell stovers they are the caramel kind and he brought me home a bottle of my favorite wine and what else flowers so i i was like oh my gosh that's so sweet and i was so excited to try these russell stover sugar-free caramels so they're made with stevia and they're so good i can't even tell the difference between um like a regular if like somebody gave me a regular caramel and then like this one i wouldn't know the difference they're just so good to me um that might just be because i'm so used to like sugar-free things now but they're so good i don't know the price or how many were in here but i have two left and they're very very hard to stay away from so maybe don't buy them if you don't want to overeat but i believe you can have like three or four for like seven points which is kind of high but so worth it when you're craving chocolate i was on my ant flow monthly you know so this was like perfect that definitely like killed the craving so good all right this one is random but this is the mrs dash salt free garlic and herb i know everyone and their mother knows about these i have like seven different ones but i just keep going back to this one you guys this is so good i put this on absolutely everything i'm about to season our chicken with it i season my hamburger meat with it, or my ground turkey with it i season this on avocado toast like oh it's so good and it's just perfect and there's no salt in it so like no sodium added love that so good so definitely try these they have a chipotle one um i know i have a couple of them in my cabinet that are so good but this one is just like for everyday use and it's just so so good so definitely try this i get these at walmart next i just discovered these as well well not crystal light i've known about crystal light but what i didn't know is that they have caffeine inside of them which is amazing because some days listen to this some days i love coffee i'm a coffee drinker that is my problem though like i love coffee so much that i will have seven coffees a day and drink no water but the main reason i love coffee so much is because it wakes me up it makes me feel better so i decided okay one coffee a day natalia and then the rest of the day you can use crystal light it has caffeine in it it'll help you get your water in it has changed my water game for sure and this wild shari flavor is 10 out of 10 so good so yeah definitely i did not know crystal light made these with caffeine in them that is just awesome and i drink like four of these a day no joke um i've been drinking a crap ton of water you guys like max 120 ounces a day i don't know what has happened to me these have definitely helped but i am not mad at it um so anyways i know walmart does have walmart brand with caffeine in them um but i didn't see the wild strawberry flavor and i love strawberry flavored things so i just got the crystal light which was a little bit more expensive but i wanted to try it and i was right i do like this flavor a lot so i definitely will be repurchasing these i think i have like two left which is kind of sad but so so good this is so good i can't and it has caffeine like what anyway next thing i literally love chai tea with everything in me i'm such like a coffee like a warm tea type person like it just soothes my soul it makes me feel things like i just love coffee and tea it just does things for me and i love it anyway um so zach bought me these the other day i asked him to pick up some of my chai latte and it's the tazo kind that you can buy in the carton but um 
he's like oh they have a vanilla chai which is perfect because i love putting vanilla creamer in my chai tea so i picked these up and holy crap so good if you like chai tea please give these a try i found them at publix they're the puka brand they're vanilla chai it comes with like 20 i believe but oh my god you guys they are they're so good i'm smelling them right now it just smells like cinnamon so basically if you've never had chai it is basically like a cinnamony tea in my opinion it's a black tea but it definitely has that cinnamony warm like creamy like oh i just love it so much with some almond milk you guys and some sugar-free vanilla syrup or creamer just depending on the day oh it will change your life it will literally change your life so yeah it doesn't have to be this brand i absolutely love this brand i feel like it's so good but try you some chai tea like i said they make it in the cartons where you just pour it over some ice and some almond milk or whatever you want and that's cool too but if you want a hot like vanilla chai oh guys it's so good Oh, another random thing, but these Stenda, Stenda, Splenda Stevia Naturals are so freaking good. I add them to everything now. Um, smoothies, tea, coffee, literally anything. Um, I'm a Stevia person. Like, I don't like Splenda at all. Um, so, I like the feel of Stevia all better, but Splenda does have a Stevia now, which is so awesome. So, yeah. I love this. I thought I would just tell you guys about it in case you're looking for a different sweetener. Um, I do really enjoy that one. So that's that. Next thing is this sugar-free Pillsbury quick bread and muffin mix. Holy moly. So I miss banana bread so much. I make a mean banana bread <laughs> if you guys were wondering. But I missed it so much. So I saw this at Walmart and I was like, if I add some bananas to this, it could possibly make a really fire banana bread. And it did. It was so good i they it is sweetened with splenda so that's like why it's so good and still like it tastes like a homemade banana bread but i mean splenda is better than sugar so yeah i love this stuff add some bananas to it do it it makes it so much better i can do a recipe on it if you want it's literally so easy i do everything the box says but i just add some super super ripe bananas around three of them so good like i said i can do a recipe if you want but i found this at walmart so good i don't know if i said but it's the pillsbury sugar-free quick bread and muffin mix in the deluxe cinnamon swirl very very good all right we're getting down to the last things you guys can you make it <laughs> all right next is this bolt house creamy caesar dressing so i love bolt house i'm kind of over the ranch just because i've done weight watchers for like six months now if not longer and sometimes you just get tired of eating the same things over again so um i switched to the hidden valley ranch i mean I, i'll probably go back to the bolt house ranch i'm just kind of wanting something new right now but i saw this creamy caesar and i've never tried it i haven't tried their blue cheese or anything like that yet just because i was so hooked on the ranch but guys this is a very very good dupe for caesar like i can tell it's not obviously authentic like fattening caesar but it is so close you still get that caesar taste with it it is so yummy so yeah i think it's the same amount of points as the bolt house ranch so good i love this stuff definitely try it if you haven't yet i definitely want to try the blue cheese next because i do love blue cheese so. all right next thing i've probably talked about this in my videos like a thousand times as well but these zero, coke first of all coke zero is a lot better than diet coke <laughs> that's just my opinion but it's like very true um coke zero takes the cake over every single diet soda in the game i used to be a hardcore dr pepper drinker like regular dr pepper um until i started weight watchers obviously and then i tried um coke zero cherry i have cases i have two cases of it it's so good and i don't drink soda every day but i definitely still crave a soda here and there like i like soda and there's nothing wrong with liking soda um i do like soda and i enjoy it so yeah i love this please try it if you haven't already they have so many variations as well they have vanilla coke zero i think ashley at fit for Hot ash um said that she found an orange or a vanilla cherry it was something good like that i don't know this was so this is so good though like these are my addiction mm so good all right i saved the two best things for last and if you want to know anything about me you will know that these two things are my staple everyday items okay so first things i'll save her for last okay first things first 
these mint chocolate yazo bars i literally tried them last night in a what i eat in a day video life-changing i would have grabbed the cookie dough one but they were i hadn't opened them they were still in the package and i only had two left in this box so i just took them out but these and the cookie dough ones are amazing you guys amazing how is this greek yogurt i don't get it they are so good 100 calories if you're counting calories so good it tastes like i'm eating freaking cold stone or baskin robbins or something it is just so good i don't understand how they're healthy i just don't get it they're so yummy five points for this one and the cookie dough one the cookie dough one is my tip top you guys i love it so much the cookie dough one but these are really good as well and i cannot try wait to try other flavors i've tried salted caramel which is good just not my favorite and i've also tried their chocolate covered peanut butter which was very good just super high in points so i probably won't be buying it again because it's like eight points but this one and the cookie dough one to die for you guys to die for next thing this is my baby <laughs> if you've watched my channel for any amount of time you probably know i talk about this a lot this is the coconut cream coffee mate i literally make zach go out of his way to pick me up this creamer because it is that good you guys i am not kidding first of all you have to like coconut in order to like it but this is the best like creamy coconut sweet oh so good i'm obsessed with it i love it so much this is my number one this is my number one favorite of this whole video this is so good if you see it snag it pick it up by 10 they're very hard to find i'm not i'm not joking like they're one of those things that I, when I see it, I have to buy 10 because they're very hard to find. When I see that they're in stock at Walmart or Target, I literally run and pick them up. This is like my third bottle. I discovered it like a month ago, but like I literally made Zach drive out of his way the other day to pick me up a bottle of this because it's that good. If you make whipped coffee, this is so good in whipped coffee, so good in hot coffee, um, cold brew, literally anything, you guys. This is my number one of the month so yeah if you could try anything from this video i pick this and the gazo bars for sure so yeah that is basically my favorites of the month i would say or a couple months um let me know what you've been loving on weight watchers i know like i said it's hard to find food right now but um i hope you if you guys see this in store that you'll pick it up and give it a try also, like I said, let me know your favorites so I can try them. And let me know if you like this video because I will do it again if you do like it. So, yeah, thank you guys so much for watching this video. Taking the time out of your day to watch this video. I appreciate it so much. Subscribe if you're not already. And like this video because it does help my channel out a ton. It helps reach new people and helps me grow. So, yeah, thank you guys so, so much. And I will see you on my next one. Bye.